Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix runtime error 217 on your Windows 11 computer. Now the first step is to perform clean boot. Now to perform clean boot, type in system configuration in Windows search box and then click on system configuration. Now go to the services tab and then put a check on the box which says hide all Microsoft services and then click on disable all. So make sure hide all Microsoft is checked over here then click on disable all and then click on apply click on ok you will see a restart option restart your computer so click on restart and after the system restart check still you are receiving the error message in that case run sfc and dism command now for this type in cmd in windows search box make a right click on command prompt app and then click on run as administrator click on yes to allow now copy the first command all the commands are provided in the video description paste it over here hit the enter key now let the scan complete the, the scan will take some time once the scan is 100 percent complete over here then run the second command so you have to copy this command but make sure the first command is 100 percent complete then you copy the second command paste it on the same window and let the second scan complete once the second scan is complete restart your computer and after the system restart you can check next step is to still you are receiving the error then in that case update your windows 11 for this open windows settings go to windows update or update and security go to windows update over here and then click on check for update now over here once all the updates are installed restart your computer in my case all the updates are already installed but if in your case when you click on check for update if you see any update let it install and then restart your computer and then check now still you are receiving the error message in that case the next step is to update your windows using media creation tool now since you are receiving this error on windows 11 so update your windows using media creation tool go to this website here also you will find media creation tool click on download now and then run this exe file Click on yes to allow. Now this will load Windows 11 media creation tool. Now click on accept. By default Windows 11 would be selected. Click on next. Select ISO file then click on next. You can save the location. You can set the location as desktop and then click on save over here. Now once the download is complete click on finish and then go to desktop find windows iso file make a double click on windows iso file then run the setup file make a double click on setup file click on yes to allow this will load windows 11 now and here you can see install windows 11 click on next it will check for update then click on accept again it will check for update now before the installation you will see the screen which is ready to install and by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer click on install after the installation log into your computer now still you are receiving the error message in that case the next step is to reset your windows 11. now before you reset let me inform you that you will lose all the application and data on your computer so create a backup first and then go for reset to perform resets reset again go to windows settings and then go to windows update and then click on advanced option and then scroll down and then click on recovery over here you will see reset this pc click on reset pc and there are two options keep my files which will remove application and settings but it will keep your personal files the next is remove everything which will remove all your personal files apps and settings so you can select the option which you want so i will go for keep my files for now and then go for local reinstall and once windows 11 is reinstalled on your computer you can set up your computer and after the setup you can log into the computer and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this runtime error 217 on your windows 11 computer so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel